We've officially landed in Malaysia. This is country number six on our trip around the world. Good morning. Today we're flying from Siem Reap, Cambodia to the capital city of Malaysia, Kuala Lumpur. It's currently 5.09 in the morning and we have a one hour drive to the airport. We're at the airport and we just got absolutely destroyed on the bags. <laughs> yeah. This is the first time we've had to pay for our bags to be checked. The first time that they weigh our bags at the check-in counter for carry-on bags. And our bags were like three kilograms over the weight limit. Yeah, or 110 USD. We're gonna go find some coffee and a snack to make us feel better. We made it through immigration and now we're just waiting for a flight. And I always love how these airports are completely empty in these small countries. Look at this. Officially landed in Malaysia. This is country number six on our trip around the world. Okay, we got to the hotel, but we realized we couldn't check in till three, so we found our favorite food spot in all the world, McDonald's again. We got some local currency and now we're going back to check in. And it is pouring rain here. We haven't seen rain in a few months, so it's kind of nice. Today we're in the capital city of Malaysia. Kuala Lumpur. And today we're gonna go explore and show you around, but first let me show you this amazing view from our hotel room. We have the famous Patronus Towers right there, the tallest twin towers in the world. This tower here, we don't know what it's called. So we booked a grab to go to Batu Caves. It was like about $10 to get there. It's a 30 minute drive there. And now we're just waiting for our car to arrive. Is this the busiest time to come here? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> Well, you heard our taxi driver. We came at the busiest time, but we're gonna make the best of it and go anyways and check it out. See some monkeys over there wandering through the people and I'm really scared they're gonna steal something. Are you? No, I have everything just strapped to me tightly and no monkey would dare come at me. So. Okay, 272 steps. Here we go. We just have to watch out for the monkeys. They're crazy. They're everywhere. Okay, welcome to the top of Batu Caves. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Caves are like raining. Watching the raindrops fall down. <laughs> Another set of stairs in this huge cave is some Hindu temples and it's the most famous Hindu, tep Hindu temple outside of India and I guess people just come here to worship and do some ceremonies and stuff. Alright, that was cool, saw some things and now we're heading back down. Bam. 
Real concern is the monkeys again because they're just littering the side of this stairway. So I'm pretty worried they're gonna try and take this camera. Found this little shop, so we stopped in to cool down and get some water. And once we're cooled off, then we'll get a grab back to our hotel. Okay, we made it back from the caves and now we're gonna eat lunch and then we can't wait to do a full hotel tour sometime in this video. As promised, this is what $40 Canadian gets you per night in Malaysia. We're staying at the Ceylon Suites, which I think is like an Airbnb hotel, long-term rental place. We have this beautiful mini kitchen here, coffee maker, stove top. And then come on over this way, we have this beautiful king-size bed with the TV and this shelf here for doing whatever you want. But the best part is right over here with this view. And then over this way is the bathroom. Lots of storage space, sink here, and a beautiful rainfall shower. This hotel comes with laundry service, a business lounge, a rooftop pool, a rooftop sky gym, and a rooftop bar. So we're going to go to the rooftop pool and show you that now. This pool is incredible and it has the best view ever. 